Hey everyone, so in this video I'm going to walk you through what you need to prepare for your B1 integrated skills in English and guide you through what we'll be covering in our sessions. There are four areas to the reading and writing section. Task 1. Here you can see long reading. You'll be given several pieces of writing and asked to answer multiple choice questions on this. So together we'll practice these and I'll show you many techniques in how to redact the information in a way that you understand so you're faster and more accurate in the exam. Task 2 we see here multi-text reading. This can be in the form of pie charts just like what you've got here or paragraphs or many more and can be really confusing as there's little difference between the texts when you first look at them. We'll work through many mental methods to help you differentiate the two. By that, I mean telling them apart. Task three, if we scroll down here, reading into writing. This can seem so daunting, but I'll focus on showing you how to actually use the above tasks to inform what you write in it. For example, this task asks you why more students should learn languages. I'll show you little tricks like going back here, we see just down below here, and to use what's already written as an example for a starting point. So it says here, learning a second language increases your brain power, which is really helpful for all tasks in life. So we can put it in this work here. Not hard. Task four, extended writing. This can seem so hard, but it's actually the fun task. You get to state your opinion about something. I'll show you ways that you can help think you think on the spot, construct an argument, and improve your overall English so this task seems less scary. If you also wish to have lessons for the speaking and listening, ISE B1, just like here, this one here, then we'll work on numerous ways to improve your ability for the test in a way that suits your learning. Thanks a lot, and we really look forward to working with you.